What's up guys, here's Sonic and today I will show you step by step how to create this effect using Sony Vegas Pro. First I recorded a model in front of the white material with lamps located behind so her body was darker than the background. Then in post I add glow effect to each scene to create more contrast with black and white and render the scenes with the same values as recorded. The reason why I rendered them is that the glow affects on masking and there are visible lines of the mask. But let's get back to editing. First you need to create white background. I used media generator with solid color for that and drop it on the timeline. Above just put the scene and create the mask so there are visible only the parts which I want. Then change the size and center a model. Now we can add chroma key effect. Choose white color as invisible and set low threshold on value between 0.4 to 0.8. Now we can add cookie cutter effect. You can choose different shapes, but I will stay with the circle. Let's add a border, change the size and locate it in the center of our object. Now let's add another scene on the lower track. One more time I draw the mask so only the hands will be shown on the screen. Chroma key with white color invisible and cookie cutter. But this time we choose different method, cut away section. So now this effect is cutting only a part of the scene. Let's add border for better view and combine these two circles. Now you need to resize the scene and locate it in the right position. And the last step is to multiply this shot, just copy it on the next track below and add rotation and repeat if necessary. Ok guys, that's all. I hope you learned something from this tutorial and if you have any questions just write them below in the comments. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.